Jamila Massey, 84, from Lenaglos, won the Lifetime Achievement Award at the UK Asian Film Festival One of the first actresses of Indian descent to star on British radio and television has won a Lifetime Achievement Award at the UK Asian Film Festival. Jamila Massey, of Lenaglos, accepted the award at a glittering ceremony at the Mayfair Hotel in London on March 14. Speaking about the honor, the veteran actress said, It was very pleasant and very kind to be recognized at a prestigious event such as the Asian Film Festival Awards. The 84-year-old was awarded for her pioneering work that has spanned decades for equal rights for black and minority ethnic actors. For many years she chaired an important Afro-Asian committee for equity, the British Actors' Trade Union. Back then we wanted roles and we had aspirations to be successful actors. We were never seen on television and theatre and it was a struggle. It was a long journey to get to where we are now, today. People are not so narrow-minded as they were back then. Things have improved for the better and you see a lot more Afro and Asian actors on our screens, said Mrs. Massey. Soap drama fans may recognize Mrs. Massey from EastEnders as Sanjay's domineering mother in the 90s or as Auntie Sadia in The Archers. Mrs. Massey started her acting career on a children's program on BBC Radio when she was only 12 years old. In 1960, a year after graduating from King's College London, she made her British on-screen acting debut in Sink the Bismarck then carried on doing radio in English, Urdu, Hindi and Punjabi. I thought I had made it. I was going to get all these roles but nothing came. I worked hard as an extra to get where I am today. I've had a very interesting career and I've loved every minute of it. But there are not roles for old biddies like me anymore, Jamila and her husband, Reginald, have called Lanidlow's home for more than 30 years. We lived in London at the time and we went driving around Wales for a week with our four-year-old son. We stopped in Lanidlow's and fell in love with the place. We've been very happy here. The people are lovely and Lanidlow's is the nicest town in Wales. There are so many friendly faces. I'm so happy to be in Wales and I love